Vinny Caravella. Alex Navarro. You would have complete just cause to not really care about something with the words Assassin's Creed in it right now, given the way things have been going with Assassin's Creed. But, Fair? I, but I love just cause. I, okay. I maybe used the wrong words there because this is nothing like Just Cause. So let's just. Are we looking at Just Cause? No, I'm sorry. No, I'm sorry. We're not. All right, Assassin's Creed. Yeah. Is there a many suffer from Assassin's Creed burnout? There is no cure for Assassin's Creed burnout. There is no cure for (laughs) Assassin's Creed burnout. But here's this might be something of a balm. I I have no problem with this. I'm still ready. They, there is still skin to flay here. That was actually not what I wanted to do. Uh, But I hear what you're saying. What is this? This is not the Saint your uh, Ezio's Assassin's Creed. Yeah, well, it is in a way. Uh, so this is Assassin's Creed Chronicles, uh, mm-hmm. China. There are three Assassin's Creed Chronicles games. I like it. It sounds like a Nat Geo thing. Assassin's Creed Chronicles, China. Yep. Let's take a look. Uh, there are three of them. Uh, one is in Russia. One is in India. This is the very first one. Uh, and, and these are standalone. These are standalone games, DLC. Downloadable content. Of, I think they're sort of loosely tied into the, I think, the season pass for Unity, but I'm not 100% sure about that. Uh, but they're like, ten, this one is 10 bucks on its own. I have located the box, Xiao Zhu. It's in the possession of Yu Deong. I'm just, we're just going to watch this. Kong's tigers, the one they call the slaver. And I'm going to fill this in as we go along. Responsible for this cruelty. I shall pay him. I like this art style. Tread lightly, sister. So all of it is kind of done, not quite to this level, but there's a, it's sort of like a watercolor painting style. I know you can kill these lesser men with ease, but I would suggest you remain invisible, a ghost, until you find your target. So what they have done is they have taken Assassin's Creed and they have uh, turned it into a uh, 2D with some 3D elements uh, side-scrolling stealth action game. A 2.5D? Yes. Uh, I don't mind that term. I know some people hate it. That's why really? I didn't say it. Yeah, I, Jeff, oh, I, I think Jeff in particular hates that oh, term. I don't mind that term. I, feel yeah, like, I think uh, it's, it's very descriptive of what this this kind of game is. Okay. So, so you are the Xiao Jun character. Uh, she is an assassin in uh, mid-1500s China. Okay. Your assassin sect has just been wiped out. That's a shame. By a Templar-controlled group of eunuchs. Okay. Uh, and you are captured in the early, the very first level, but on purpose, because you want to get in, you want to find out what they're playing. Infiltrate. Plan- yes, you sort of, you, you do in, indeed infiltrate. Uh, we're still pretty early on here. This is the first stage after my escape from all of that, uh, where I took out my first target and whatever. So we're still learning a couple of things here, but by and large, this is a game in the Assassin's Creed tradition uh, where being stealthy is uh, not only important, uh, yeah. it is, I mean, it's, it's not only recommended, it is extremely important most of the time. So you're saying not in the recent Assassin's Creed tradition. Yeah, <laughs> so the thing with this is that- Oh, you, sick burn! Yeah, that's fair. I mean, I, 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 as someone who just sword stabbed his way <laughs> through Unity almost yeah. exclusively, uh, it is kind of nice that this game is actually uh, mostly focused on you not engaging in combat, and when you do, uh, only out of necessity. So right now, I am uh, working my way through these different junk boats uh, in the port of Macau. And I'm looking for another target. The story has not really revealed itself in any great amount yet. Mm. Uh, But I'm figuring out little details as I go along. But mostly, it's just about navigating these levels, which are surprisingly large. Did you play Bloodwick? Did I play Bloodwick? I don't think I... I can't remember if I played Bloodwick or not. When you said junk boats, I suddenly... Like a lipid deposit just got digested and opened up a memory, and saipans and junk boats because that's all like oh, forget it, boy, <laughs> holy cow! I said like a weird flashback. Anyway, yes. Uh, so this... I can assassinate this guy. I'm gonna do that right now. Oh, that's cool. There's your oh, point five. Damn it! Well, I hit. I thought I hit the assassinate button, but I apparently did not. So I'm just gonna kill that guy. Uh, there was your point five D, huh? Yep. So, Mark of the Ninja? Yes, I did play uh, a decent amount of Mark of the Ninja. What do you think about this and Mark of the Ninja? Uh, you Different know, enough? It, it, there, there, are, there are some similarities, there are some differences. Mm. Uh, this is definitely trying to be a little bit more noticeably Assassin's Creed-ish. Okay. Uh, that said, you know, I think the things that it borrows from those kinds of games uh, are actually, for the most part, used well here. Well, what do you think overall? 
Uh, what I played so far, I have liked quite a bit, actually. Okay, so these two guys are talking to each other, so they won't notice if I just hop over their heads here. Uh, and in fact, if I just sort of drop um, down. Oh, what? What's going on? Hey, uh, what? No, gotta go. They noticed. Gotta go. Hey, uh, don't mind me. It's kind of on. I gotta go. Going up here. Oh, they're uh, throwing shit at me. That's not good. He threw a, what I, I can only assume is a Chinese star. Yes. Uh, very low health. Looks like yes. you only have two bars. Yeah, and I mean, that's, or you gain a little bit of health as you go along. Like, I started out with one bar. Um, but that said, yeah, it is, again, it is very much about you not necessarily engaging in battles with multiple dudes. Like, one, you could probably take on no problem. Mm. And there's actually a pretty decent little sword fighting system in this game, uh, which is, 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 I think, well done. Like, different than the actual Assassin's Creed, like, uh... Parry yeah, it's and... well, it sort of is like that. It, it's like whenever someone's about to attack you, the little icon appears above their head, and you just sort of push the direction toward them and press B. Hmm. I'm playing the Xbox One, by the way. Sure. Uh, is it a little Batman-ish? A little bit. Yeah. A little bit. But what isn't these days? Oh, uh, I have a gun. Oh. He has a crossbow. That other guy did not. There it is. Okay. All right. So that was very poorly uh -oh. done. Uh, they know something's up. up oh, yeah, it's a Metal Gear alert system. Yep. Huh? So I'm just gonna hang here for the moment, wait for that counter to go down, and then they'll eventually decide. Ah, everything's fine. <laughs> so, I'm sorry. I, I know in the beginning you said the year, but uh, where in the like mid 1500s is where we are right so now. So what are we talking about in terms of the uh, in terms of unity? So Ezio is here. Uh, it has nothing to do with Unity, at least not so far, but Ezio, uh, there's a training sequence early on where Ezio, a, a, a very differently voiced Ezio, uh, is sort of showing you some sword moves and oh, stuff. Uh, but that is, so far, the only instance I've seen of, of anything directly connecting it to the stories of the other games. Okay. Can you do, like, a double assassination here? Uh, I, I have not, if there is a double assassinate option, I have not found it yet. Uh-oh. Ah, uh, fuck. I really did not intend to drop down there. I was trying to jump over him. Well, that's interesting that they tied it in. I mean, I know he, or I'm pretty sure in the lore, he travels the world. Kind yes. Of doing his thing. All right, we're gonna we're gonna try and be more careful this time and actually pay attention to what we're doing. I played this section earlier and beat it on my first try, so I'm I think I'm just. I'm getting the trying to talk and play at the same time jitters. You getting the quick looks? Yeah, I'm getting a case of the quick looks. All up in me. Problem is when I drop down on this floor. Yes. Uh, you make some noise. Sound. Make some noise. Oh. All right, those guys are dead. No one uh, else. Last just, known position. Yeah, no one else is quite sure where I am or what I'm doing, but they they can't do anything about it from here anyway. Do you regenerate health? It does eventually come back, yes, once you're out of combat. Uh, is, are there subtitles to turn on for hearing what these dudes are saying? Uh, I have not seen that. Well, that's just... Well, that's, 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 you snapped it, baby. Yeah, that I did not mean to do. Uh, yeah, there's nothing I can set from here. Okay. I mean, this would not be beyond. So yeah. I assume they're saying, what was that noise? I heard something. Well, and a lot of the incidental, incidental uh, enemy dialogue is in Chinese. <laughs> which makes sense. Yeah. It's a game about, you know, China. Cones. Okay, it seems my health just regenerated there. <laughs> It must have been nothing. Oh, I remember what it was I was supposed to do now. So there's a thing, and there's, there's, unfortunately I, I could not see the, the thing that I was supposed to do, but uh, there's a little ceiling section here that I can kind of... Oh. This is how I was supposed to get around that by not dropping Got on the floor. It. I see, I see. And if I don't want him to see me, I can just yeah. pull up like that. And unfortunately you've got a giant red sash, but what are you going to do? Ah, you know, they can't see that. Oh, Oh. There's something hanging from the ceiling. It's, Things are happening. It's nothing. You walk that way, I'll walk this way. There's my assassin vision. Oh, uh, yeah. Which kind of tells you the vision. path that they walk along uh, here. Oh, I see. That guy's doing an amazing job of patrolling those five feet. Yep. <laughs> I just checked that corner again. Nothing's changed. 
Well, check it again. You're an asshole. Let's go check again. Oh. Maybe mm. something different happened. Mm. That corner still looks the same. So those curtains move. So if they're in that visual range and they can see that I'm moving along there, oh, they'll yeah? see it move along. And they'll, they'll alert to that? They will alert to that. There's still nothing there. I'd like to patrol a different corner if I could. At the same time, as soon as they start talking to each other, they completely lose the ability to see anything that is happening directly behind them. Just like real life. You know, guards. Yeah. Mantle. Yeah. When, when did you get a... Did a little slide there. Was that the, a checkpoint? Uh, that, so basically what that was, yeah, there are little checkpoints here and there throughout the stages, because these stages are actually quite long. Mm. Uh, and you get graded uh, based on how you do, like, you know, how stealthy you were, if you ended up brawling with people instead of, you know, being an assassin, right. like, awesome. you lose some points for that. Ammo. So okay. you have these, uh, these side things here, uh, these are throwing knives, these are firecrackers, mm. these are noise darts. Okay. And they can be used for distraction. Uh, and also certain environmental things like the throwing knives come in handy when there are certain paths you can't get to But you need to like kill a rope or something to make that happen <laughs> kill a rope. Yeah, or you just like knife this guy right with the throwing knife I mean, I suppose I could yeah Oh wait, nope didn't kill him. Nope uh, What is the oh that that got him what's the up on your d-pad that is just whistling oh so I can whistle if I want to. Huh? Guy's like, oh. Yeah, like, wait, like, what's going on? Oh shit! I knew I heard whistling. So that was all done very badly, but I survived. Yeah, man, you know. Play how you want to play. This is a boat. I forgot you're on a boat. Yeah, I'm on several boat. boats actually. This is like a whole docking area. So it, it is giving you, uh, awarding you for doing a good job of killing everybody though. Yes. It's not penalizing you for that play style. Well, so it's penalizing you when you... Like take hits and stuff, Well, right? when you take hits and also when you're spotted. Like that, oh, it doesn't okay. like it when you're spotted. But you, you can kill anybody you want. Yes. It's okay to, to assassinate guys. It's not okay to be spotted. Got it. And have to get into Don't like one-on-one -on -one brawls with them. Okay. Be smooth. Yeah, those backgrounds are neat. Yep. Yeah, I really like the art style. The settings, you know, it's cool. Like I like that they're 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 trying something different with it. Um, Whoa. And I think that I, I I think that the India and the Russia games also have kind of their own distinctive art. I hope so. Like in the cultural style. Yeah. All right, so this is like your your eagle view sink point, and this kind of gives you access to the map, mm. which lets you see how much there still is to go. And oh boy, there's still a bunch of this. What's your objective? My objective is to get to the end and collect some things along the way. <laughs> that's, that's a pretty good objective. I mean, you can see that, like, like so escape the Chinese warship, kill the three Templar informants. Okay. okay. Point five D. Man, that guy's walking back and forth on a, mm -hmm. like, the mast. You gotta re You can't see me. You can't see me. I can't see anything. How do I get down? Like, there's not even, like, a ladder or nope, anything. No ladder here. Oh. No wrist blades? Uh, no wrist blades that I've seen. Uh, everything at this point has been... Sword? Rope dart. Uh, sword or uh, any of those other little like throwable items. Mm. Whistling. <laughs> They're real brutal. Yeah, well, you know, these guys will kill me if they. Oh, oh, oh. no, nope, nope. You didn't see nothing. I think I saw something. I'll wait nine minutes, and if I don't see you, I'm moving on. It was probably nothing. It was actually, what, nine seconds and, uh... Now I'm good. You know what, I think there's probably nothing. Nine seconds seems like a fair amount of time to wait. Yeah. Oh, I, I, I was, waited too long! I was wrong. <laughs> so wrong. Is that, uh... 
the analog stick are, is at different levels of run, or are you actually holding a run? Button? I'm holding the uh, the right trigger button to okay. run when I want to run, and left trigger to do the uh, the 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 crouching. Yes. You know, make sure you keep that hay on your ship. Yep. For hay reasons. We are 2.5Ding. Yep. Cross over to this. Mm -hmm. uh, this is, I think, more ammo for my throwing knives. 0.5 your way over here. Mm hmm. Run across these little pylons. Nope. <laughs> That wasn't where I was supposed Wait, to go. It looks. It really looks like where you would do. You can use your eagle vision again to, to path it up if you need. Oh no, that was the. Uh, it showed you the. Um, there you go. Yeah, the this is what I patrol actually... path is what it showed you. Right? Is that guy going to spot you? Who's the uh, looking out there? Wait, what is not... this? What is that all? That's about? what I'm trying to do here. Oh wow! Look at that. But yeah, I think, I think you missed the boat. Well, no, I wasn't supposed to get on the boat. I was supposed to move it over there. Can you kill that guy in the background with a knife? Uh, not while I'm on this plane. Mm. I think there might be some stuff over here. Let's see. Oh, yeah, there's like a animus little, little animus dealie there. Some enemies will unleash a volley of strikes in a single attack. Will then just push forward so toward the attacking enemy. Let's go again. Good. Keep going. You've got it. Now let's deal with enemies that block your attacks. Use a standard attack against the enemy with a shield. Okay. Try again. Enemies with shields will repel standard attacks. Use a heavy attack to degrade the enemy's defenses. Good. Keep going and destroy his shield. Good. Keep going. Excellent. Now finish the job and kill him. Remember, you can also roll over an enemy to bypass his defenses. So roll over? Yeah. So if we're when you're when you're blocking, if you press A, you go over the the guy. Oh, like somersault? Yeah. I feel like I'm actually skipping something here, so I'm going to go back to that boat, actually, that one I moved earlier. Sure, you feel like the path has... Yeah, it's like there's a lot of stuff happening there, and I feel like maybe I should just go over here and see what's actually sure. happening. Sure, you're looking for a dead end. Maybe this was the uh, extra bit. Could be. Maybe this is how you get that fragment. Or a different fragment. Yeah. Or a different That's fragment. what it was. It was just a separate fragment. What if you jump up there? That's glowy. Actually, yeah, you know what I can do? Whoa! That nah, wasn't it. There Dang, it look at you! So now you're out of those, right? So uh, For the moment, yeah. So you wouldn't have been able to open that shortcut if you were well, out of Well, usually them? there's ammo stations near where stuff like that is happening. Okay. So I haven't run into any issues with like having ammo for like necessary traversal stuff. Just, okay, are the ammo stations unlimited? Uh, they, they seem like they are, yeah. I don't want to say that definitively, because I haven't run into an issue where I've, I've run out of stuff, but yeah, I think so. Man, if you only knew how to assassinate people in, two, in at two at a time, time yeah. I mean, you have X or Y to assassinate. I'm assassinated! What's that ring That's a bird there? cage. Oh, this, will that bird squawk? Yes. Hey, anything on the wall? Oh, huh? ball. Good. He's got a shield. Come on, hit me. Hmm. And now you're dead. How about that? I don't like it. Uh, so are all glowy things... Was that Templar? All the glowy things are things you can interact with? Yeah, like, so this is a hiding spot Got right it. here. Can you take out that bird? No, I can't kill the bird, sadly. I'm trying to figure out how to get back over to that guy, but, eh, whatever. Oh, the guy who was on the back Yeah, plane? that guy who's, like, sort of patrolling around over there, yeah. but whatever. Not that important. Figure it out later.
You knew that already. That didn't work. You got crushed. I got crushed. Oh. Hide dash. Yeah, hide dashing is uh, basically when you're in a hiding spot. If you're close enough to another one, you just press in the direction and A, and you just dash right to it. Okay. A little, uh, splinter Cellar. A little bit. And don't get assassinated. So does the bird only get upset if you make noise? Yes, if you are if you are walking or if you are running or or attacking near it, it will get mad. Birds. Yeah, birds are. Wait, dicks. so can you just not go to the right and bypass that whole? Theoretically. Slidey thing? Uh, I don't think I can actually get over there if I do that. Okay, so I just have to run as soon as that goes all the way up. Nope. Mm. Gotta go all the way. Come on. Uh, did, ooh, you did it. Yep. Bronze. Look, a person. Hey, hey, I... I... Now that person is dead. Hey. He had to make an example so you know you would know. So yeah, now anytime I'm in a darkened area, uh, if lantern I lantern guy, to, if lantern guy happens to come by, he will see me. Assassinate. That's like he's got a lantern. Yep. What? What? Oh, but I have a sword. And now you're dead. What? Nothing about a lantern in this cool. What is that telling you to do? There's a there's a thing there. Just have to figure out how to get down there. And that's how. Sort of important probably. Yeah, it looked like it was an actual objective. Yep. Run 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 run. Hmm. I assume you fall in the water, you... Yeah, you generally don't want to do that. Don't want to do that. Assassins don't swim. In this game. Can you pull people off the ledge? No. So, these kinds of assassinations don't result in you pulling them away. It just results in them dying and laying there. Oh, weird. Huh. Wouldn't but you... I can pick up his body and throw him back Oh, that's, that's interesting. They would notice the body, I assume? Yes. That's the if I dash. left the body there, they would have noticed it. That look like you maybe used a wrist blade. She has like a toe blade. Oh, man. <laughs> that's what it was. Toe pick. So now do you go, ah, man. I would have been like, I don't know where to go. Got it. Hey, she's English? So she has an English voice, but like, she's Chinese. Okay. Like, all the main story dialogue is in English, but all the incidental dialogue is in Chinese hmm. by default. She went to school in the UK. Seems that way, yes. This guy just keeps looking down here. Yeah, like, you're just gonna have to do your thing. Can you hide dash right through their line of sight? Not or through their line of sight. Okay, so they would see you? Yeah. You're not like invincible? It's just fast? Yeah. But as you can see, I made it around, so yeah. that's the important part. Hey, what's over here? More ammo? Ammo. Uh, 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 somebody's me. somebody's me. climbing up there. Uh, oh. Is there anything you could do against uh, projectiles? Uh, you can dodge them. There is a dodge, but I'm not. I'm just hammering on the attack button right now. I'm surprised that worked, honestly. It is? I, like usually I wrong. die when that happens. Alert. That guy's all like, what's going on up there? So you, you stay in combat stance while they're in alert? That's not like something you could toggle off? It seems off. like it just kind of stays <laughs> that right. way, yeah. Another big boat. What do we got over here? The size of that boat. Oh, that's where I was before, so. Hmm. What's up? Guy. Let's see. Let's look at the map. Where are we going? What do we got here? Mm-hmm. Looks like you went into some, like, debug mode. 
Wait, what's up here? Uh, have the animus fragments led to anything other than just collectible land? Nothing significant okay. at this point. Er, I'm patrolling too. They never let me be in the conversation. Eh, okay, while they're doing that, I'm gonna go over here. Let's see what we're dealing with over on this, this side. This thing, this boat. Job is sail bars. <laughs> Oh, okay. oh, that was nice. <laughs> that worked out so much better than yeah. it should have. You're the best assassin. So these, this is a reinforcement area. You see this like door here. Mm -hmm. So if you get spotted here, another guy will come running out, and usually that is bad. Except when they get hit by their own guy. Evidently, yeah. What's all that about? It's like a hatch closed. I've got a lantern. It's okay, I'm not hiding in the dark, so he can't see me. Hey, what's up? <laughs> Why you gotta come up in my area, man? You have to jump over these barrels. Can you assassinate from in there? Nah, he knows I'm there. Uh. Oh, damn. Oh, he smacked you with a crossbow. If I had just tried to dodge a little, I would have been fine, but I wasn't. Uh, how, how long? Well, this is the first level, right? This is the third. Oh, the third We're level. in the third memory like, right now. Third memory, okay. Yeah. Uh, how, does this seem like the longest so far? Uh, thus far, though the second one was pretty long, too. Mm. <laughs> We, have again. Were you able to see uh, how many memories there are? They I have not seen how many there are total. It seems like this game's probably at least a few hours, but I don't know the total. God damn it. If I just actually try to block that. Rain still went in certain hiding places to avoid. Oh, Alright, I'm going to try these guys one more time, and then maybe I'll just try those other dudes. I haven't finished Unity. I'm not surprised. I never. Uh, what was the other one? Rogue. Yes. Oh, Rogue is better. Did Rogue come to PC? Uh, yes, it did recently. <laughs> you know, when it, maybe when I get a free forty hours, I'll take a look. Was the general consensus that Rogue uh, was maybe the better of the two? I didn't finish Rogue, but I liked what I played of Rogue. Um, I, th I think it is. it definitely feels like the direct-to-video sequel to Black Flag, but uh, I thought it was reasonably well done, hmm. at least what I played of it. Um, I wonder if playing both of them back-to-back -back is too much. It probably is. Um, but that said, I you know there's, there's a lot of likable stuff uh, in that game, especially if you liked Black Flag. I did like Black Flag. I would, uh, I would have played Unity and Rogue too, but uh, I just ran out of time. Yep. This can't be going well for you. Oh, no. Dodge, huh? Will they kick you into the water? God damn. I am just. I should. I should really be trying to approach this more stealthily. Sure, do it. Ready? I'll uh, mm, just go like that. Mm, Thank you, Vinny. That should, I mean, that should just clear your mind. Um, so I can only get up to around here. Well, so basically where that, that pillar thing is. Um, like, I can't jump back. What about this uh, leap over them move I've heard so much about? Well, you can only do that when you're in combat with them. Can you, can you assassinate this guy's Achilles heel? They'll see him. But... Sneak up behind him. Oh! You bopped him in the head. Done. 
that that should not have worked. What was that like bop him in the head move? Is that like when you run up against somebody? No. Nope. Oh no! He damn was, it! Nope, nope. I wasn't trying to do that. I was trying to get up there. God damn it! Ah, I'm falling. I was trying to get up around the side because yeah. he was looking down there. That wasn't actually where I was trying to go. Have you have you kind of fought with the controls much at all? Or is Here that and a... there, okay. but by and large, I think it's been it's, fine. the the controls have been pretty well done. I felt like, um, but there have been definitely a few moments where it's like I'm trying to jump here and then it jumps me there and then I died. <laughs> That does happen. All right, we're gonna try this for real now. This is gonna work. I believe it. Need to wait for him to come back. Let him do his little little pass here. Control this amazing stretch of dog. I have a shield. Still talking. He's dead. He's, he's definitely not getting up. This guy's just gonna kind of keep looking around here for the foreseeable future. <laughs> Drop my keys. Oh, there we go. Shit. That's what I needed. And you're not getting those keys back now, buddy. <laughs> well, that's interesting if you were able to just do a totally different path the other way. It seems, yeah. I, I mean, this is the first time I've really encountered any like multi-path stuff. Get on that boat! Oh no, this is that's not how these things work, right? Yeah, no, I gotta I got these poles to jump across here. That's weird. Poles didn't have shadows, but you did. Okay. Invisible pole. There we go. That's what we needed. Boat is in. There's a guy there, though. So Hit him with a firecracker. I could probably do that. That doesn't seem necessary. Yeah, but necessary doesn't really matter. Ow! Johnny! What? Johnny. <laughs> nope. That firecracker oh, really did destroy him. <laughs> We'll go a little further and then we'll call mm -hmm. it, but... Yeah, you probably just got a checkpoint, yeah. Yeah. Just ace this guy. You don't even have to light him. Light my mom! I haven't seen the, uh... Flurry of attacks you were warned against. I I'm curious to see how complicated the combat will get. Yeah, so far it's just been like they've just added more stuff to the enemies so that they're able to deal shields, with that. Right. Yeah, shields is, is you know, the, there was a whole thing with the crossbow guys where like you have to learn how to dodge their mm. timing and that stuff. Like, I wonder if there will be a hey, you have to get behind this guy to stab in the back or something. Yeah, I imagine there will probably be someone along those lines. Oh, the backstabby guy. Oh, there's a heavy crossbowman. That's a new one. He's just he's not heavy. He's big bone. Look at all these guys. Yep. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, beautiful night. Nothing untoward going on over here. Ooh. Yep. Uh oh. Get that guy. Oh. Where is he? Is he gonna like get more troops or something? He doesn't know what he's doing. <laughs> you don't really know what you're doing, do you? I'm fighting. I got a shield. Oh. <laughs> Damn. You were desynchronized. Yeah. Yeah, up to this point, like the first two levels, uh, combat was much more of a uh, implied nuisance than something you like had to do. Well, it seems like the shields have shields have added. Yeah, these guys are, are a little tough. I'm sure I, what I should actually be doing is trying to just avoid them instead of trying to kill everybody. Mm -hmm. That would probably be the smarter move, because they're all on paths that you can usually get around without having to. Nope. Nope. Can you not drop down? 
Not here. Y'all can't see me. I'm over here. You don't see nothing. Well, I gotta jump. I forgot they can jump over those little things. So like, I don't really know what's happening. <laughs> it's weird. It seems like they stay in that cautious state longer than they do in their alert state. Get him! The little eye icon lets you know they're about to turn behind them. So that's how you kind of predict that movement. What? Too much information, Assassin's Creed. Hey, it's important information. Nope. That was that was poorly timed, Alex, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, well, you know. That was <laughs> I was, <laughs> I was waiting for that other guy to move, but he didn't move, so then I needed to... Oh, see, he looks back over his shoulder quickly. Yeah, just take that dude out. Now he's going to go this way. Oh, then the body's going to... I'm going to peek in here. Hit the floor. Yep. But you can throw the bodies in those little dark places, right? If you can... It, yeah, but that requires some pretty quick motion okay. to pull off. Wow. Uh, he's going to poke you, poke in there? Not that guy, though. Wow. Huh. It's that guy from up there is the one who sort of caught sight of me for a mm. second. This has just been a shadow. The heavy crossbowman. Mm-hmm. Well, you are in a pickle. A little bit. What's your character's name? Uh, Xiao Jun, I believe. Okay. Yeah, come on over here. No? Hmm. I think I need to get to that ladder. Hmm. <gasps> nothing. Don't mind me. Nothing, nothing. Nice. Nope, nope, trying to get out of here. <coughs> Just trying to get out of here. Don't mind me. Nope. That guy definitely minded you. Yeah. Well, anyway, that's that's a basic idea of what uh, Assassin's Creed Chronicles China is. Uh, if you are into the stealth action killing stuff thing, uh, but you are maybe a little tired of the open world 3D 3Dness of regular Assassin's Creed, this seems like a neat little alternative. Yeah, do you have a price on this? It is 10 bucks. Hey, and, uh, on. A myriad of consoles? Yeah, I think it's on... It's at least on Xbox One, PS4, and uh, PC. Or I think it's on PC. I'll, yeah. uh, I'm going to take a look at this. I think you should. I, I've been having fun with it so far. Uh, I, don't, I really wonder how long it is, but it uh, seems like it's, it's kind of cool. I wonder how much story stuff is in here. As somebody who did not play uh, the, the most current ones, uh, I wonder if I'll miss out on stuff, but... I'm sure that, yeah, I, I haven't really dug too deep into, like, what the Animus Fragments are or, like, what they're telling you. I don't know what the F is happening in Assassin's Creed anymore. Yeah, I don't know. This, the, you know, history. Okay. History and murder. That's pretty much what's happening. Fantastic. Yeah, that's, that's the end of that. That is Assassin's Creed uh, Chronicles <laughs> China. It's in stores now. Check it out. Thanks, Alex. Thank you, Benny.